towards the beginning of June. I was asked by a friend, Jake, if I wanted to join him in building a cabin in Alaska for a couple weeks in a remote part of Alaska, but came to the conclusion that I didn't want to pass up this opportunity to go explore Alaska and um, set up uh, potential opportunities in the future as well. So I said yes, and uh, glad I did. It was a great experience. In the short amount of time, um, just a little more than 10 days, we built, uh, got the cabin all closed off, walls, roof up, windows and doors in to get the cabin ready for winter. And uh, there's still a lot of work to be done on it in years to come, but uh, made a great start, especially with the time we were given with only four of four of us building. We spent one hour. Oh, it's like 45 minutes in the truck. I don't want to hear it. <laughs> 70. What do we hey. have? Let's go with Eight, 80. I'm 70, telling the story. 75 hours living in this thing. Horrible. <laughs> <laughs> so we'll do a skid system like this. Okay. So instead of, you can kind of see how it. Yeah. Fully 16 by 24. Yeah. Um, and this four feet will be recessed with a loft for, for the loft. There'll be a loft in here that's eight feet. So that's cool. There'll be a, a loft and stuff. Yeah. Yeah. So it's nothing fancy, but. Yeah. Leaving it open to days. be able to do an addition on the back. Long this long is the building here. Do an addition on the back someday. Yeah. See if I can uh, get a picture of you upside down again. Did you see that one? I thought you was up at the boys were calling out. Expect it to go so down so quick. Oh, whole thing bug right You got a set of stairs. Good job. You reclaim forever. I went right where you wanted. You're going to have a little space under the cabin. Yeah.
Nope. No. They're playing, huh? You could hear him grunting. That was me. <laughs> yeah. Not bad for our first cast. <laughs> All right, I've been fishing with this froggy thing and I've been getting a bite at least like uh, every other cast. I just can't get them on the hook. See if uh, I get any better luck. Yeah, ah, oh, I thought I had it. Okay, so we got all the blocking in. Next step is to get this Tyvek wrapped and we're gonna overlap it so it runs down the side of the, of the joist all the way around. I'm in the mud hole, a little stuck. Hopefully I can get out with the winch. Um, I'm not too worried about it. It should come out smoothly. I'm a little overloaded. Um, yeah, four wheeler is getting hot, so decided to take it easy and winch out instead of gun it. I'm so glad he invited me. There's no way I would have uh, ever done anything like this before. <laughs> you're glad that I invited you? When would I ever do something like this? <laughs> uh, never have I ever forged four glass windows on a canoe <laughs> and uh, ten foot, <laughs> ten foot long trim. All right. Off we go. <laughs> I felt like I'm trying to take a dock out. <laughs> Yep, it's two feet of water, four feet of mud. <laughs> good luck getting good luck getting out.
<laughs> oh gosh. Yeah, yeah. Okay, go. Gonna pull up my way. Sandy or muddy? Uh, this is the part I actually walk across. It was in between. <laughs> Not great. Oh yeah, you got it. All right, last, Alrighty, last shallow One, spot. One, two, three. One, two, three. Uh, one, two, three. Uh, nice. You got a grunt to make it sound heavy. There you go. Well, it is heavy. <laughs> <laughs> Just last damn to go. Damn. <laughs> She floats. Tipping me over. Oh. High five. We made it. Hopefully, we, now that you said that, we're gonna like tip. In Utah, that's a huge fish. Yeah. I, I think we're gonna get a light rain. I'm just looking at the clouds and watching the air pressure drop. Check to see if the the walls are leaning out enough that we're not leaning in. That was lean, that's leaning in too much. Can you both sides just one? No, we're good. Okay, so I'm betting that on this cast, if both of us cast, we'll both get a pike right on this one shot. Play in? Yep. I'm, go I'm getting one. Come on, bite it. Oh, close. I had two chasing it. Well, that's fair. I mean, with the bet, we both got hit, so. <laughs> <laughs> Now 
we just finished cutting off all the tails, we're going to run a fascia board. It's a 2x8 all the way across the front. And that will give us um, some rigidity and something to nail our boards to. Jake is putting the sheets up. He's got a little harness on. Make sure he doesn't die. And getting it done. Got two days left to work. Had the roof done. Takes up on top. Had great weather the whole time we've been here. Um, rained one day, just off and on. But the uh, roof's coming along. Let me get up on the stump so you can see it. Right to the bottom ridge where the metal is. So it's coming like three inches in or whatever. It's been three and three and a quarter. Just right. Kind of right in the middle of that flashing. Yeah. Okay. It's looking good. Okay. All right. I don't know what I'm doing, except that I'm fishing for salmon. First time. On a river. I'm gonna give this salmon fishing a try. Hopefully, it works out. Really pretty. Looks like I might get some, a little bit of rain. Got a, an old can of bear spray here that's expired. We're gonna try and see if we can uh, get a video of how far it shoots and hopefully it's even still good. It's expired back in 2018, so it's four years expired. Let's we'll see if it works. Hmm. One handed, just in case I'm pushing the bear back. <laughs> okay, you ready? Yeah. Bear! It works. Huh. That was That's cool. it, huh? Semi-anticlimatic, but kind of cool. <laughs> then reholster.